Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with that deck, and today we're playing some more Phasmophobia. And before we get started, I just wanted to show off the dead cool little uh, tweaks they've made for the Halloween uh, season. It looks dead pretty in there. Aqua spotted a uh, scarecrow outside watching us at all times last night. Because I was playing with Aqua, Mike, and Raven. I can't remember the end of Raven's name, but it's people that she has played with on Game Edge server. It was hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. I couldn't record those videos. Like it was kind of good to talk. <laughs> But it was still hilarious. I may um, may record tonight if um, we're all playing. I don't want another EMF reader. Um, another photo camera, lighter, UV light, two cruise fixers, two video cameras, three tripods, all of the smudge sticks. I'll take the salt, a flashlight, a motion sensor. Don't want parabolic. Excuse me. Sanity tablets and thermometer. I have already bought things since I died yesterday. One minute. Mike seemed a little bit far away from my face. Right, what have we got? Edgefield Professional, Tanglewood Amateur, and Ridgeview Roadhouse. We're not going Ridgeview. Let's go for the professional one, shall we? Because I'm not doing any of the big ones, not yet. So there has been an update. It didn't give us the maps like we really, really hoped for, but there's been some bug fixes, and like the spirit box now shows you what they say. So we hopefully won't get confused when, you know, it's telling us that it's going to kill us. Things like that. <clears throat> A few uh, performance tweaks and, you know, stopping FPS drops, disconnecting from games, stuff like that. We have experienced it when we've been playing multiplayer. You might not have seen it on camera because them sort of bits I cut out, but... Yeah, it seems like they're getting to grips with, um, you know, just sorting out the minor details that do cause big problems. Can't fault them. If they've got plenty of people playing it, which it seems like they have if you check YouTube, loads of videos of phasmophobia uh, going up. Uh, it's nice to get a game that's not got as many bugs. Right, I'm going to shut up so we can listen to the radio. So, discover what sort of ghost it is, take a photo, dirty water in a sink, and witness a ghost event. There's the name. Likes people alone. I've literally just had a tip. Have they fixed this yet? No, the light still goes off. And that still switches off between rotations. Fair enough. Uh, I did receive a tip from Rain just a minute ago, saying that um, people have done tests... With the timer, I'm unprofessional, so I've got no grace period. People have done tests with the grace period where they've gone in, like, screaming the ghost's name, and as soon as the timer's up, the ghost has began a hunt and just, like, come across and murdered them. I try to get into the habit of not saying the ghost's name now unless I want to anger it. So, yeah. There is that. Let's just get a couple of lights on in here to start with. just until we can narrow down exactly where we need to be. Ooh, right. We'll leave that there for a moment. Ooh, I did just hear footsteps. I'm not sure if they came from upstairs or not, though. Oh, no. Last time we did this, I died. You know what? I am going to put that there for a second. There's definitely footsteps upstairs. Whoa! Look at that activity! I'm going to make a safe room. Doom, doom, doom. Anybody know what that's from, by the way? I know what it's from. The, the, the tune of it. I'd be impressed if you can get it from my singing. Um, it's a game that I do play, well, we used to play quite a bit. Let's try and salt this up. In fact, let's do the bathroom because it's going to be closer. And I don't need that anymore, so let's just litter. That can go down there. 
I want the other one as well. I want to be overly cautious this time. After yesterday's episode. 11 episodes without a die. Uh, a, de a die. Without a death in solo. I'm quite proud of that one. We only had one death last night and we were absolutely taking the mick. It was hilarious. One death on the very last one and it was uh, Aqua, unfortunately. That can go there. Right. I can pick... You know what? Let me go and get the camera. Because then I can take a photo of that. Take a photo of the board. Again, I'm trying to miss, miss out words in case it can hear them and it triggers it in some sort of way. And hopefully if it is upstairs, I'm not angering it too much by being down here. What room are you in? Where are you? Where are you? That's going to say... Oh my god. Right, in case you didn't quite get what that Ouija board was telling us. That said basement. Oh my god, we've got another dead aggressive ghost. What's my sanity like? Oh Christ. This is why I bring four with me. Oh, I really don't like the idea of this. Where did I put the thermometer? Uh, also, I did see a video on YouTube. I believe, I may be wrong on this, but I believe the higher level you get, the more difficult the ghosts get. Because somebody that's level 200 had a ghost that was hunting like every two minutes. It's a bit cool down there, it's throwing things. Right, just there. Yeah, I know I'm being particularly quiet. Turn the circuits off. Breathe. Alright. We want to get one of these. And put that on there and turn it on. <clears throat> We're going to give that a second. Um, I'm going to take the book before anything else. Now it is going to be terrible trying to set up down here. Because if we need to get out, we need to run all the way back up. That just spiked. Just giving it a second. I know it's a bit fragmented from this distance, but 
I want to try and be close to the door. I'm sorry, but unprofessional, I'm not going in with that sort of activity. It could go straight back up, but we can't stay outside forever. things out here. It is awfully cold out here. How about we go and get the other camera? A problem I've got is if I'm in this hallway and it slams the door on me, I've got to backtrack, which could be a terrifying moment for us. I think it's in that hallway bit before it. Oh, ghost orb in there. Uh, ghost orb. We won't even look, so that's not exactly going to narrow it down. I can't see the book from this distance. Uh, ma -ma 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 -ma. Give me this. Give me this. Just to try and track it a little bit. Are you close? What do you want? Where are you? We'll leave that alone a bit. Go try him. I don't even know what that door was. Uh, that noise was. That door seemed slightly um, a jar. I'm sure I opened that fully. Um, so we've got ghost right in. Let's have a look. Freezing temperatures. Or EMF five. Well, that narrows. Uh, takes out my theory. Because I was about to get the fingerprint scanner for that door. I'm just going to take another load of these. Um, ma, 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 ma. Well, the freezing temperatures... Ooh, I witnessed a ghost event, apparently. Um, the freezing breath we can get normally. Just by walking around. Freezing temperatures... Or EMF 5... I'd rather not go in there at the moment. It doesn't seem happy with my existence. What's my sanity at? We're in the 90s. We're very, very good. Slow and steady with this one. Slow and steady. I want to get a photo of the book as well. Don't know what's happening with the floor there. It is throwing things around. Oh. Oh, sugar, let me out. Let me out. Oh, I've got goosebumps everywhere. Oh. <laughs> It went up to a 10. Absolutely went up to a 10. Oh my god. Well, EMF 5. There we go. I just saw the red light on the EMF thing. It's just like, nope. Uh, dare I go for a, a photo of the ghost? No, not really. It shut that door for a reason. And it did not like me trying to open it again. 
So, I think I'm going to respect its wishes. We know what it is. We can get the uh, the Ghostbusters in after us, and they can sort it out. $160. Yes. You are now level 89. Brilliant. And I'm still on about 2,000-ish cash, even after my death yesterday and rebuying all my items. But that's thanks for the multiplayer stuff off camera. Oh, dear. Hey, we've got two basketballs now. Brilliant. Uh, not that there's anybody here to play with me, but... Um, yeah, I hope you guys are still enjoying watching this. I'm not sure how long I'm going to go with the uh, the solo hunts, or if I'm just going to start editing like my multiplayer stuff, like cutting it into single videos, single hunts sort of thing. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think, because if you're liking the solo hunts, I'll keep the solo hunts as solo. And I'll keep doing the team hunts for the weekend. Damn it. Uh, for the weekend episodes. Just so you can see what we get up to off camera. Again, brilliant fun if you've got people to play this with. Absolutely recommend it. But that's where we're going to leave this video off. Sub 20 minutes again. I'm quite happy with doing shorter videos. One hunt per video is more than enough for me. Anyway. Hello. Get a 50 plus dollar photo reward. Nice. Yeah, anyway, that is going to be where we're going to leave off today's episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments and feedback greatly appreciated as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.